Oh, it's that time again. Kelvin. All right, our next service call. Steam system. The guy's house sounds like it's going to explode when he turns on the boiler. I bet she's got a clogged wet return. What do you think? Yeah. Probably. And I'm just so, I'm laughing right now because forget about calling me Plumber Mike. Oh, I'm effing Saint Mike. Oh, I'm a saint because I have the patience to tolerate <laughs> you, Kelvin. <laughs> oh my God, I love the comments. Keep, guys, keep the comments coming. And remember, if you're one of the 80, 5% of the people who watch my channel videos and aren't a subscriber, so you must subscribe now. Saint Mike commands you to subscribe now. Stay tuned. We're going to check out this steam boiler. All right. We have a nice, well, I don't know what this is about. We've got a nice finished basement. And uh, at first I thought this was gas piping. All right. Because they didn't use steam fittings. All right. This two inch, I should know this inch and a half, sorry, is feeding a uh, cast iron slant fin baseboard in the front uh, first floor. You hear that banging? That banging sound is water violently exploding as steam traveling 50 miles an hour through this pipe hits it and it violently explodes. First, we got way too much pitch there, but our bottleneck is right there. We have an inch and a quarter line here, and we have inch and a half there. And right there, if you see that difference, this is where water is accumulating. And possibly in this fitting as well, right there as well, possibly as well. Way too much pitch on this line and water is spitting out of the steam radiator air valve on these two front radiators. That is a telltale sign. Look at this. They didn't even use the right fittings. Come on, man. Oh man, I sound like Joe Biden. Come on, man. I'm like, come on, guys. If you are gonna do the job, do it right. Look at this. What can we see in there? Uh, more of the same. same. More of the same. Sorry, guys. All right, so let's take a look at the boiler. Don't even ask. I have no idea why two 9,000 BTU units are here. Maybe they're going to put a wall here? Possibly. All right, we got a Burnham. Looks like an SIN5. Yep, SIN5. Pressure troll is set to 2 PSI. Differential set at 2. That can come down to 1.5, one, 1. Prove me if I'm wrong. So here is our Hartford Loop, which could have been a little bit higher, but it is what it is. Our equalizer in 2 inch. Steam header coming up. Other one is capped off. We got one here. Looks like this is the wet return for that one. That one's there. This pipe here to there. One inch wet, wet return. Looks like they replaced that in copper. That goes to the Hartford Loop. This other line cross still got the asbestos there and they wrapped that asbestos with some kind of tape and unfortunately oh look isn't she pretty an mpe 240 mpe 240a isn't that so pretty i love them and i bet you they got these this expansion tank from supplyhouse.com real oh, yeah. people real service supplyhouse.com yeah. shout out to supplyhouse.com anyway So, wet return, wraps, should be wrapping around this basement wall, and somewhere here-ish, because here is our bathroom, there's our steam main coming this way, across here, and then across this header there. 
So we got a lot of work here. He is not gonna be happy. Hear that? Hear that water trying to rush? It can't escape. It can't escape. It can't escape. Clog but return. <laughs>